Hello, today's devotional can be found in the Joseph Smith translation of Matthew chapter 16, verse 27. Break not my commandments, for to save your lives. For whosoever will save his life in this world shall lose it in the world to come. Alright, so here's the thing. Life is short, but that doesn't mean we have to treat it as if it were a party and... We need to go from one place to the next as fast as we can and as recklessly as we can. We don't need to be stupid with the time that we have and the opportunities that we are given. Being reckless and irresponsible with our choices is not going to bring us anything but trouble. It will not bring us happiness. It will not bring us peace. It will not bring us joy. Breaking the commandments and engaging in sinful behavior will only put burdens of sins upon our backs and it will do nothing for us but trap us in those choices until we seek a way out we will become dependent on those very choices that we were taught to avoid and we will have nobody to blame but ourselves if we think our life is boring and we want to save it well Engaging in sinful behavior is not the way to do it. Because it will do nothing but shorten our life and limit it. You see, pursuing good opportunities strengthens our lives and makes it feel like it can be longer, but Pursuing bad opportunities shortens our lives because we put ourselves in danger every time we pursue something in the name of carelessness and irresponsibility. So when we break God's commandments, we are actually putting our life on the line quite foolishly when we think we are saving it. But we are invited to use our agency as we will. We can do as we wish. But there are consequences to each choice that we make. And any behaviors we may engage in here may result in a loss of eternal blessings. And we need to be very careful about that because there are many eternal blessings that we can have if we just allow ourselves to stay on the straight and narrow and handle our lives responsibly. I mean, everyone's got their agency. But, you know what, I guess we have to learn that lesson for ourselves, each and every one of us. Breaking the commandments just for moments of pleasure will put us in Satan's power, and in Satan's power we can't have an eternal life of joy. And I guess we have to learn that on our own. And with that said, I love you all so very much, and I say these things humbly in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.